Hello my dear friends and family members welcome back to max class uh, I'm taking a max class on the topic tables and multiplications okay so in my last class itself I end the video uh, with a uh, one note that is we uh, we have completed the up to uh, two from two to 10 tables isn't it so and also from each and every classes I am instantly saying that why what is that need to change uh, change the ordering of the tables and to read okay so that is for example we always used to study in the series 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 in the series we always used to read the tables so what is a big question is there here isn't it so the big question is what does it need to change the series after to uh, jump to the 5 and 5 to jumping to 10 and then again we are coming to the 4 and again 3 so what is the need to jumping here and there like in a monkey means because always if you read it on a one strict track means you will get bored or you will get very you can feel very tough okay because the tables it's like a so for example if you are studying English means like in a, uh, letters that is A B C D isn't it that is a letters it is very essential one isn't it so very essential one you can uh, you have to be very uh, clear and um, uh, you get understand what are A after what is a letter B after E what is the next letter F so you should be very clear isn't it so only you are reading ABCD for a, a pre kg LKG as well as to UKG so what is con why they are concentrating more on uh, letters uh, English uh, letters means because uh, uh, because that is going to be helpful for throughout your life so once you are studying after you are studying first standard second you are studying means you you can you can uh, we can uh, learn any kind of uh, words with the help of those uh, letters that is the basic things why they are more concentrated on the uh, a b series so that is the same thing here also in a mathematics also the tables is like and you can think it it is like an a b c d in the mathematics so once you are well versed in the table nearly 2 to 12 so on my point there is no need to at 12 you should be very clear about 2 to 10 for at least for a first standard second standard students you should be very clearer from 2 to 10 tables okay so that is the reason so we are going just we are finding out which table is so, uh, uh, feel very simpler so we just choosing those tables at very first okay so how what are the tables we feel very simpler means we have we can take it like a two so i uh, told you the two table is very simpler so what is the method we followed in a two tables in my last video at the end i will told you the method also if you've seen you can remember about it okay don't worry if you are not seen also it's not a problem i'm telling the two tables we read in the uh, uh, skip count by two method okay that is skip count by two method so what is a skip count means we are going to skip it skip it the numbers for instance 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay i've just take it up to 1 from 1 to 10 i've taken now we are going to skip by 2 means 1 2 so i'm selecting the 2 1 2 1 2 1 2 1 2 so this is the skip count by 2 method so 1 into 2 is equal to 2 2 into 2 is equal to 4 3 into 2 is equal to 6, 4 into 2 is equal to 8, 5 into 2 is equal to 10. So this is what skip count by 2 method. So the skip count by 2 method, you should be very uh, very well versed in this uh, method. Why, why I am saying means not only skip count by 2, you can also practice skip count by 3, skip count by 4, skip count by 5, skip count by 10 because skip count by 6 is uh, where you can feel it very hard. So up to 5, skip count by 2, skip count by 3, skip count by 4, 
skip count by 5 and skip count by 10 you can do the practices and also in my i think in my second classes or third classes i have told you about how to recollect the uh, these are numbers skip count by two method or a tables how to recollect or how to get memorized i have told you about some tips and tricks how to memorize those things isn't it and also i have told you some tips to the kids how to recollect these tables and also for a for small example i am telling that before doing any new thing for example at the early morning you will just at early morning or a morning you will just wake up and will you do the brush so brush is the one new thing that you are going to start a day so before going to do the thing you have to uh, tell two tables after brushing after you will play something and you can then you will eat your breakfast so that is the first breakfast in a day so the before going to do a something you have to tell any any table like a four table you can tell or a five table you can tell for like these ways i've told you some tricks also using those tricks you can memorize these kind of uh, tables okay so two tables we have followed the skip count by two method so skip count by two method is not only going to help you for uh, tables and multiplication if you read skip count by three skip count by four it will be uh, take you for a long way because what is the main use of uh, doing a max or what is the main ambition uh, in a max means as fast as you can that is the big question here so everybody can do the multiplication everybody can do the any problems but what is the big question mark in a mathematics means how the time you have consuming when comparing to the other one how the time you are consuming because in a mathematics the time plays a very major role okay so for the time consumption for example if you are a first standard or second standard kids you can take a long time it's not at all a problem when you are growing up if you again you are taking a long time for a simple multiplications for example if you are studying a 10 standard 11 standard means there will be like a 12 steps 30 steps 20 steps there will be steps where longer so for example in a second step you want to do something multiplication here means if you take a long time here to do the multiplication or anything for a small calculations you will for a, uh, to complete the 20 step see how many how much of time you will take it so to con to control the time we need to be well practiced in the skip counting method it will surely it will take you for a long time okay